KP family, it's Karen P and your girl is back with another video. Listen, if you're not already part of the KP family, go ahead on and hit that subscribe button right now today. Be sure to turn your post notifications on. Give this video a big thumbs up, comment down below, and follow me on all social media platforms. It's Karen P, I-T-S-K-A-R-E-N-P, straight across the search bar. And be sure to subscribe to my other YouTube channel, Karen P Reacts. Listen, KP family. Y'all see the thumbnail, y'all see the title, so y'all already know what it is and what it ain't. So with that being said, KP family, let's get into this video. Y'all see the steam coming up. Yeah, I got that water boiling. Because, uh, yeah, the penny pasta got to go in the pot. Yeah. So we got to get this uh, homemade bake ziti <laughs> on the go. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead on and uh, open it up. KP family, great value. This is from Walmart. Yeah. So, yeah, in she goes. Okay, um, I mean, that pot, it'd be a lot, KP family. It'd be, ooh, I'm just gonna, should I put the whole, I'm trying to think, should I put the whole thing in the pot? Because this, this thing, he'll be flaring up quick. Um, I'm gonna just gonna, I'm just gonna put all of it in there, and whatever I don't need, I can go ahead on and uh, freeze it and uh reuse it again so yeah get that to a good boil let it get you know nice and soft the way pasta should be and once it get you know close to the kp family we're gonna go ahead on and um cook this here ground beef y'all this is 100 percent grass fed ground beef so <laughs> y'all already know Y'all already know. Stay tuned. I'll be back. All right, KP family. Um, the pasta is done. Uh, boiling. You know, it done got to the consistency it needs to be at. So I'm gonna go ahead on and uh, set it to the side, KP family, because now it's actually time to cook the uh, the ground beef. Okay. Put this stuff over here. Put it on here. Set it right here. All right, time to cook the ground beef. No, I got y'all prop in a um, different angle, different position than the first time. My apologies. Um, I got something else on the stove cooking because my son is like, he's so hungry, he can't even wait for the food to finish. So I'm frying him up a few pieces of chicken wings, KP family. Right, so yeah, the ground beef is in. All right, I need to go ahead on that uh, that burner. That was low, well, not really, but yeah. Take it off. Some. And yes, I'm going to season it, Casey family. Okay, y'all, see that. burner for a little bit. That burner was real hot. Sorry, y'all can't really see my face. But yeah, Everglades seasoning. Okay. Season it up. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, the ground beef, KP family, I actually got the ground beef from um from Aldi. Got it from Aldi, KP family. I'm really supposed to cook, open up two packs. I forgot, let me grab the other one because um, it's something that I wanna do on top of it. You know, like, you know what? That's all right. We gonna do it, leave it the way it is. We gonna leave it just like that. Okay, so yeah, the ground beef is cooking and uh, once it get done, I'll be sure to uh, check back in with y'all and show y'all the next step. And of course, y'all be sure to drain that fat when you get them cooking, okay? You know how to? Yeah, I always do it. How you do it? With the, um, the strainer. With this right here. I 
All right, KP family, I'll be back. You can stop the camera. KP fam, I got a little bit of sausage left. I'm gonna go ahead and put this sausage in with this uh, meat, this, you know, with this here ground beef. And let it all cook. He got me in here cooking chicken wings for him, KP family, but he's still looking for more food. I'm not understanding that. You don't know what I'm going through. Yeah, he, he got a headache, KP family. He has a headache. So we got some company in the kitchen today. All right, KP family. Um, I already drained out the fat from the uh, ground beef, okay? It's gone. Ain't none in there. Now what I'm gonna go ahead on and do is uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get rid of this water, drain the water from out the pasta. I didn't do it right away because you know the ground beef was cooking and I didn't want it to stick. I don't want the pasta to stick together. Ooh. So bum, we lost a few pieces of pasta, but it's okay. Yeah, give it a nice little shake. Okay, hopefully y'all can see me, but it's in the strainer. I'm gonna grab some butter. All right, so I got the butter, I got the cheese. Let's go and put this pasta in this here pot and mix it up. Let's see. Like I said I ain't cook all of it. Let me see something because I, with the pan that I'm using. I want to make sure that I have enough room. Oh, I could actually cook more. Okay. So yeah. Uh oh. I could actually cook more in there. Yeah, I was doing a quick little measurement, KP family. Plus, I got the meat too. So we're just going to go ahead and put all of it in there. And uh, now, KP family, as y'all saw, hopefully y'all can see good. I'm gonna go ahead on and add the meat into the uh, the pasta, which I was supposed to put a little bit of butter in it. I'm putting uh, one tablespoon of butter. Okay, one tablespoon of butter. Okay. Hold on, let me position my camera a little bit better. All right, KP family, I think this is way much better now. I think this is much better. Y'all can't really see my face, but we ain't cooking my face. We cooking this pasta. <laughs> so let me go on and add some of this here, uh, meat up in here. And like I say, I don't want to. I don't want to use all the meat because I want to use some for something else. You know, for a little topping, okay. So yeah, it's going in. You know, give it a nice stir. Give it a nice stir. Get all the meat up in there. You know, all in between the pasta. Mm-hmm. All in between the pasta. And don't be stirred. Don't be stirred, cause it ain't gonna bite. <laughs> so now, KP family, um. I'm gonna go ahead and try this for the first time, this meat flavored pasta sauce that I got from um, Aldi. And I just hope that uh, it, did, it doesn't disappoint me. My hand's still wet, barely open it up. All right, there you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right on up in there. Right up in there. And by the looks of it, I probably needed two containers, two bottles. But you know what? I ain't even finished using what's in this bottle, so I should be good. Y'all make baked ziti at home. Y'all let me know how do y'all do y'all baked ziti. What ingredients do y'all use? What ingredients do y'all use? Don't be stirred, let me know. Don't be stirred. 
sir, let me know. I know Kendra probably wants some sugar up in here, don't it? I know. <laughs> no, no, I don't. Oh, okay. Because it's not the other type. Oh, okay. Like the, the Spaghetti? Yeah, the flat one. Okay. I was putting on my chin. Oh, okay, good. So, yeah, it's coming along. We're going to go ahead and put a little bit of water in this here uh, bottle. Because we're going to get the rest of this here Z. I meant this spaghetti sauce, pasta sauce up out of here. Mm-hmm. Boom. Just like that. My son is in here watching and learning. Okay, so he could be able to do something like this when it's time for him to start cooking. So KP family, um, I'm gonna sprinkle up some of this here Mexican style cheese. Okay. Sprinkle it up in there. Okay. This here should be good for now. All right, nice and cheesy. Nice and cheesy. I know some people, when they make this, they put egg in it. I'm not gonna put no egg in mine, KP family. I'm not putting egg in mine. And if y'all put egg in there, I mean, I wanna know. I really do. Let me know. Let me know. Now, KP family, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I gotta. Before I put this thing here in the oven, I need to taste this thing. Oh. Because your girl be doing that. I've been doing this for years, KP family. I've been cooking for years. I've been cooking for years. So I got some um, provolone cheese, KP family. Ooh, we that good old Publix provolone cheese. And um, I don't have any gloves, as y'all can see. But I'm just going to tell a little, you know, Break them up and you know, y'all see it. How you feeling? You feeling better? Yeah, we still waiting on that chicken. I'm waiting on the chicken. I know. I'm gonna put it on this here burner when I get done because this burner, for some reason, it cooks faster. And I can't wait for the cookies. The cookies done. I can't but then you doing all that, then that means you ain't gonna eat no dinner. Y'all hear that, KB family? Yeah. Oh. What's that brown stuff? That's from the spray. No, because I'm saying like I can get one. But Go ahead. Only one. Oh, he baked some cookies, y'all. My son baked some this cookies. This is what he turned. This is how he... Yeah, come over here so they can see. You got to step back some, though. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that chocolate. It tastes good. Let me taste it. Oh boy, you did that. I didn't burn. Okay. You did that, bacon with can. Thank you, fam. I forgot I had a little bit of this ragu. Ain't no sense of having this go to waste. What you gonna do? Put some more in You already know. You know, you know, you know, you know. Told you y'all ain't learning. Mm-hmm. Hold on, but you know we stopped. We did another video. We didn't even get to show them. <laughs> what was it? When you started baking, you ain't let you gotta let them see it. You come. But yeah, KP family, I'm sorry. We got a lot of we we doing a lot right now. We vlogging in two different places. All right, so here it is. I think we'll put a little bit more. Uh, another slice of that cheese. Should I? Yeah. Another slice of cheese, KP family. And after that, it's going in the oven, y'all. It is going in the oven. I wish I had some Parmesan cheese. You know, sprinkle on top when they get done. But it's okay because it's still going to give what it's supposed to give. A baked Z, baby. What did you put there after this? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Do me a favor, be my assistant real quick. Give me that pan and put it right here. Hold on, let me move these right here. Get the pan. Put the pan right here. Thank you. All right, now I gotta put it in the way so y'all can see. Hmm. Unless you put the pan back. 
and put it down. So. And you don't wait. Hold on. All right, um, KP family. I'm going to go on and put this uh, no, I'm just GD gonna make up sure here. Oh, okay. Because this is like. Oh, yeah. That's called what? Baked CD. Mom, what is ZD? That's just a name. A little, I guess, an Italian name or something. Oh, this is plenty food. That's a lot. This is going to last. That can feel a whole Thanksgiving. <laughs> Y'all heard her? So, yeah, we just transferring everything we just made. Can I try one? Into this little pan. Okay. Oh, look how full that is. How it tastes without it even being baked yet. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, your yeah, KP family, that is plenty. Oh, I did all that and forgot to mix the. I, listen, I forgot to save some sauce for this. Y'all see that? Oh, I gotta, I gotta come up with something. I forgot to save sauce for this right here. Okay, family, what I was supposed to do was put some of that uh that spaghetti sauce, that pasta sauce in this here pan with this meat, and I totally forgot. So y'all make sure y'all don't forget that step. Make sure y'all don't forget that step. But what I'm gonna do now, KP family, what I, I did that because I just want to sprinkle some some extra meat on top. Mm -hmm. That's all. That was the whole purpose of that. Just a little, you know, baked ziti with a twist. Y'all know I like to do my thing a little different. And I like to come up with like different, you know, different ways to cook. So, I mean, it's still gonna, it's still gonna get eight. This is food. This is gonna last us two days. I mean, a few days, not two days. So that was the top to the, that was the bottom. Put on the table and have a seat for me, please. All right, y'all see that, KP family? So now I'm going to go ahead on and uh, sprinkle this cheese on top. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Baked ziti, honey. Almost looking like a spaghetti, uh, a lasagna. <laughs> what you say? Mm -hmm. Chicken wings still cooking, y'all. All this time. Still cooking. All right, so yeah. That's how that goes. We done with that. Got a couple of pieces of, two pieces of uh, provolone cheese left. And I'm just going, you know, just put it around. Nice and cheesy. Canopy, that's a lot of cheese. Honey, it's, it's baked ziti. Sorry, it's baked ziti, y'all. It's baked ziti, honey. And we're going to put it in the oven just like this here. Mm-hmm. Um, I forgot to buy uh, garlic bread, y'all. But I might do a little twist. I might, you know, make my little own of a different way. I just got to get my thoughts together. Kendrick! Let's see if he's going to help me. You going to help me make some garlic bread? Or some toast? Oh, I got some help, y'all. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, go ahead and open the oven. Ooh. Nice and hot, Mommy. Yeah. All right. Give y'all a close-up of the baked ziti, y'all. Mm-hmm. Y'all look at it. Oh, it's only one thing left to do, y'all. 
review it. Y'all stay tuned. And just like that, and just like that, I don't start eating KP family. <laughs> but dinner is served, okay? Yeah. Homemade baked ditty and some chicken wings, y'all. No vegetables, none of that. Well, we got some tomatoes up in here from the sauce. So, can't say we have no vegetables. I'll take that back. No. Yeah, no vegetables because tomatoes are off. It's actually a fruit. It's considered a fruit. So, yeah. Have you got me? The baked ziti is a 10. It's a 10. Honey. There's nothing different that I would do. Mm -mm. Well, I take that back. I would, you know, add the, uh, the spaghetti sauce to the uh, meat that I had set aside. Yeah. Yeah. But you really can't tell the difference. Tastes real good. Alright, let's give them to these Wayne's KP family. All flats. Mm-hmm. Um, I had actually got all the flats from Walmart, y'all. Check out that grocery haul because, honey, Walmart shot the out of me. Mm-hmm. They shot me, honey. So, yeah, chicken wings, dry. No sauce. Nothing like that. Deep fried it and then air fried it. Mm. It even tastes so good. What? <laughs> Y'all. I rate this whole meal a 10. A whole 10. Mm, 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 mm. You know what? I want y'all to hear what Kendrick got to say about the food. Hold on. All right, KP family. There's Kendrick. Dinner time. Good. It tastes good. You like it? What about the chicken wing? Mm -hmm. That part. Y'all, <laughs> stay tuned. All right, KP family. Y'all done heard what Kendrick had to say about the food y'all so yeah this cooking tutorial has come to an end thank y'all so very much for tuning in again if you're not already part of the kp family go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now today be sure to follow me on all social media platforms give this video a big thumbs up comment down below and uh excuse me be sure to subscribe to my other youtube channel karen p reacts once again, this Karen P I T S K R E N P straight across the search bar. And uh yeah, your girl is out like O U T. Thank y'all. Good night.